Good day to Dr. Faiza. We are from Group 4 and for the company name, we choose Amazon during our group assignment 2. So let's begin for our group assignment presentation. Good day, Doctor. My name is Chuyo Ket. Today, we will present the warehouse management in Amazon. Amazon is one of the world's largest online e-commerce retailers. It is also one of the big five companies in the United States, information technology in such street, and other companies are Google, Apple, Meta, also called Facebook, and Microsoft. Amazon has more than 800 logistics sites in all around the world, including the delivery session, fulfillment center, shopping center, and airport hub. The main services provided by Amazon are retail service, consumer electronic products, digital contents, publishing, business service, and computing service. The headquarters of Amazon is located at the city of Washington, United States, and Amazon publishes at 1994. In every period, Amazon is an online bookseller railway website. Currently, Amazon has selling various types of products such as several media, consumer electronics, beauty products, health and personal care items, jewelry, government fruits, toys, homes improvement items, tools, and others. Good day, Doctor. My name is Lao Junxiang, make sure number 27811. So today I will present on the inbound activities of Amazon Fulfillment Center. So the first one is receiving process. Amazon will liaising and working in connection to show the list of expected delivery during the whole day. And then after the truck will arrive at docking area, then the product will take off trailer by forklift or manually built in pallets. And then associate will receive and sign the paperwork upon receipt to ensure the accuracy of and up to date of data record. And then they will scanning the unique barcode of the product based on UPC or FNSKU to ensure each of the products have shipment ID in the system. Or for quality control process, Amazon will conduct fulfillment by Amazon FBA inspection by checking. So the first one, they will check on the leveling of package to ensure that they have accuracy of product information. Make sure it's query, readable, and easy to scan. Or for packaging, they will ensure prevent leakage and breakage by doing carton drop test. Or for quantity per carton, they will make sure outer carton will not have mixed SKU and Amazon Associate will ensure all product meet technical specification to prevent any defects such as detached piece and Amazon also tighten the quality control standard by calling his vendor to test their product and let before sell it to the customer. So for put away process, all the items will receive and will put at the black tone and conveyor belt and then Amazon will use palletizer to carry heavy tote in a safety and quickly way. And then associate will evaluate each item whether they need additional preparation or not to ensure they will not be damages after item had been stored. And they also perform a title verification of the product to ensure the title and the packages mesh together. Moving forward to storage process, Amazon will store the product either in bulk or in individual pickable location. But for media product, it is stored at library type shelving to avoid misspeaking. While for high value and perishable goods, it will be stored at climate control environment. So the associate will identify the product size, navigating 2D barcode, and yielding way to one another depends on the items. And all the items will randomly put at yellow stack bins. And besides, Kiva Automation Technology will use to increase the speed of process and accessibility. And Amazon Associate will scan the barcode of the product and shelf before storing it. Hello everyone, my name is Yap Kong Wei and my metric number is 270217. The first upper activity is the picking process. In the warehouse of Amazon, there are two types of the method to carry out the picking process, which are the manual picking and the robotic picking. In the manual picking process, the worker will carry a portable RFID scanner and drag a jewelry with the yellow boxes first. After that, the worker will go to a specific shell location that is shown in the scanner to pick up the order items. At the same time, the Amazons also use the T-Bar robot to carry the parts that are full of goods to the picking stations where the picker will take the relevant items from the parts. After that, the worker will scan the items and place them in the yellow basket box in order to send them to the next project. The second upper activity is the sorting process. The Amazon is highly dependent on the latest technologies in order to improve the overall efficiency and productivity. There are three types of the automated sorting technologies used by the Amazon for sorting operations, which are automated conveyor, auto sorter, and the vacancies robots. By using these innovative technologies, it can shorten the sorting sorting times and increase the warehouse profiling activity efficiency. The third output activity in the Amazon's warehouse is the packing process. In the packing process, the item will be sent to the packing stations first by using the yellow box. The workers will take out the items from the yellow box and scan the barcodes of the items for accuracy. At the same time, the computer system will suggest a suitable box size based on the product and the exact quantity of chips required by the employees. After sealing the box, a white barcode will stick on the package 
and link all the relevant information about the package. The first output activity in the Amazon warehouse is the shipping process. After the packing process, the package will undergo the slam process. The slam machines will add the shipping labels to the package and do the final quality control check. At the same time, the Amazon is using a shipping sorter to analyze the package labels to decide where and how quickly the order's items should be received by the customer. After that, the package will be looted onto the delivery trucks and shipped to the customer. Thank you. Hello everyone, my name is Lai Sun and my metric number is 269629 and I will present about reverse logistic activity. Amazon will provide the poly bag which made for recycled material and help the customer to pack at the Amazon drop-off location. The customer also can put in the box and put it outside the door after they inform all the details in the Amazon apps. The Amazon workers will pick up the parcel from the door outside and they will scan the barcode using the mobile phone before journey back to the Amazon warehouse. After the parcel has arrived at the warehouse, the worker will start to sort the item to the storage process through the conveyor. They will put out the item from the boxes and put into the box yellow plastic boxes and go to the return storage area. Amazon Warehouse will using the Kiva robot and truck lift to lifting the return products to the racking system. After that, the workers will resorting the puzzle to the disposition places where some of the items need to be resolved, refurbished, recycled and repaired. The program item that cannot be repaired or unsold out will become the waste product. The worker will scan the barcode on the wasting product using the barcode scanner before the truck send it to the waste and disposal area. If the product is sending wrong to the customer and need to return to the owner or supplier, Amazon Warehouse will pick up the product, scan the barcode on the product by using barcode scanner and pack into the boxes. The worker will put the boxes on the labeling system for the label the details such as time, date, time, owner name and so on. And finally, the boxes will go through the loader conveyor for shipment process and return back to the owner or supplier by trucks. Next, I will talk about the safety and security aspect in Amazon Warehouse. The first one is safety safe. Amazon using handheld service to identify the hazard and the flaw always make aware in real time. This device can provide a fabulous environment in warehouse and provide a fast identifying hazard in warehouse. The second one is robotic test fast. The robotic not only help the warehouse to carry the product, but it can identify the dangerous place and give the caution to the workers. Third one is trailer docking and releasing system TDR. Amazon train their workers in using TDR and fire tablet to reduce the risk accident in the trailer yard. This system will check the trailer and make sure it is safe before depart from the dock door in warehouse. Number four is safety cameras. This is an augmented reality program that provides a Amazon Warehouse to the workers to enable them to know more about the environment in warehouse to prevent any dangerous situation. And the final one is PIT checklist. This PIT checklist that provides by the Amazon Warehouse to the power industrial truck PIT operators to enable them to go through the pre-operational checklist in warehouse. This PIT checklist also can provide a fast, efficient and fast safety workplace among the workers when they do the operational checklist. That's all for me. Thank you. Good day, everyone. My name is Wong Zijian, and I will discuss about the material handling equipment and other facilities in warehouse. So, material handling equipment refers to tools or machines that are used in the warehouse to move and store the goods. And Amazon has invested a lot of money into to improve its warehouse. And the most well-known system that used in Amazon called Kiva, which is using robotic technology to assist with the movement around the warehouse. And now Kiva is rebranded as Amazon Robotics. There are a few types of MSG used in Amazon Warehouse, which is storage and handling equipment, engineer systems, and industrial material handling trucks. The first is storage and handling equipment. For example, like racks, shelf, bins, and drawers are a fundamental component in a warehouse. They provide space to store inventory and easy access of workers to collect the inventories. In Amazon, yellow shelves, single rack, box, and bins were used to store the item in the warehouse. The second is engineer system. That is the type of material handling equipment that are usually automated. For example, conveyor systems and automatic guided vehicles are a type of engineer system that can help improving at the efficiency of a warehouse. In Amazon, conveyor and Amazon robotics are used in the warehouse to assist in smoothing the warehouse process. The third is industrial material handling trucks. That includes hand trucks, pallet trucks, parking trucks, other pickers and side loaders. These transportation devices have different functions that can make them suitable for different operations. In Amazon, forklift, hand pallet truck, and powered pallet truck were used in the warehouse to lift and load the items. Next, I will discuss about the layout of the warehouse. There are three main types of the warehouse layout, which are U-shape, I-shape, and L-shape. But in Amazon, it did not use these three types of warehouse layout by using a dynamic location system in its warehouse. 
So it refers to storing item in, in completely random places. Placing item in random place will improve the speed and efficiency of Amazon workers to pick and pack to customer. Why? Because uh, the item will be nearby of the workers to pick and to pack to the customer easily. Although the worker can place item at random shelf, scanning a barcode on the both item and the shelf by using a handheld computer is needed. This will allow the computer to keep track of where every item is located. Thank you. In conclusion, Amazon has utilized the advantage of communication technology, published a lot of websites to make it easier for customers to purchase products via online without leaving the house. Amazon also gradually towards using robotic and automation equipment to increase the efficiency of warehouse operation and minimize the mistake of operation in warehouse. Amazon also has good handling in the safety and security aspect in warehouse. Um, this is a key of Amazon success to become one of the big five companies. So every, every warehouse management is important to help the companies to successful. That's all for us. Thank you.